Okay, so we've got the re-release of the Future Stars Reunion Player Pick. Let's open a load of these up and let's see what we can get. Do you guys want to kickstart your Foot22 team off with a bang? Head over to MoogleFactory.com for the cheapest, most safe and reliable coins and use the code NERDFIRE at the checkout for 5% off your order and get yourself some Foot Coins to boost your team right now. Okay, boys, so today we are back with a brand new video and as you can tell by the title, we are here again for the Future Stars Reunion Player Picks. Basically, if you didn't know the other day, EA's confirmed that in four 48 hours, we could get our hands on another Future Stars Reunion player pick, which dropped the other day as well. If you guys didn't see it, it's basically, you can get any player that had a Future Stars, I think, from FIFA 19 onwards. I think that's when it was first out anyways. And if they've got a special card this year, they can be in the player pick. So the likes of Vinicius Jr. with his headliners, we've got Team of the Year moments, uh, David. We've got Foden's Team of the Year honorable mentions as well. Loads of really good players you can get in here. So hopefully today, we see some of the good ones in these picks. If you guys have opened up your pick, let me know in the comments below what you managed to get. Was it good or was it bad? Anyways, that is enough of me talking. Let's get straight into the picks and then I'll see you guys after. Okay, the future starts for Union. Player pick is back. It is the second one. Obviously, the exact same requirements. It's fairly expensive, I guess, in a way, but we're still sending it. I want one to watch Sancho, okay? I don't care that he's not had an upgrade. I just want him. So give me a one to watch Sancho and all will be good. Just like last time, though, we are kicking them off with a reveal. Okay, we're going to reveal. Definitely. I don't know if we're going to reveal all of them, but we're going to reveal mine. So let's get the image in the way. Let's get it opened and let's see what we get. All right, here we go. First player is about to appear. Come on. Sancho or head on his Vinicius Jr. I guess I'll take as well. Okay, that is an absolutely awful start. Anzu Fati. As a f let's just keep going because that is, that is actually horrific. Like, that is a really bad start. Oh, no. That's Mount as well. We've got... We've been given two informs. Please... I saw someone the other day get four informs. I saw someone the other day get four informs. Please don't do this to me. Please. No, no, no. What is it? What is it? No, 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 no. Stop this. Stop this. Nah, nah, nah. This last one's got to be a dub. We're screwed. No, what is it? Who is it? Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, that's a way to end it. That's a way to end it. Okie dokie dokie dokie. Oh, thank you very much. Gwen Doozy, get in the team. I'm happy with that. That's dubs. That absolutely saved it. Then. That's, that's a really good card, by the way. Like, that card's very good. Thank you. I, I thought we were about to get four informs and I was about to cry. There we go. But obviously, if you didn't know, we're taking Gwen Doozy. Get in my club. Thank you very much. All right, shout out to my man, Dario Daz. He wants a reveal. So we're going to go for another reveal. We've got to go for as many reveals as possible. Let's do it. All right, here we go. Dario Daz, playing them one, is about to appear. All right, we've got another mount. That's two mounts in the play picks in a row now. That's not good. That is not good at all. We don't want any mounts. All right, player number two is about to appear. What do we see? Please don't be... Oh, my God. Not again. Not again, EA. That's two informs already. What's going on? Please don't be three informs again. I'm begging. It, wait, I, actually, give us three informs and then just give us a mad player for the final one. I'm actually done. What is going on? What have they done to these player picks? They've done this on purpose. No, you can't be doing this, EA. Please tell me it's not four informs. Please, for the love of God. It's a rule break because it's not four informs. It is a rule break. It's Risky. <laughs> I mean, uh, Kudovski is probably the best one. Actually, is he? Or you can take Bastoni for the fodder. Um, uh, yeah, that's pretty bad. He's gone for Bastoni. I mean, probably is the best because you can at least use him for fodder, I guess. All right, shout out to the man Fred Effects. We got one on the Xbox. This is going to be a normal one because it's quite hard to start reviewing on the Xbox. Sancho! Oh, Sancho! Yes! Why was that not my account? Why was that not my account, EA Sports? Why was it not my account? I mean, it's it's pretty good. I hope I can get up my RTG, mate. Oh, Sancho would be beautiful. I'd love a Jaden Sancho. Sadly, it's not on my account, though. So I don't know if he is as much in love of getting a Sancho as, as I was. But probably not, let's be honest. I mean, he's not had an upgrade. That's the only disappointing thing, I guess. But he is the highest rated. And yeah, there we go. He is chose Sancho. Let's get on to the next player pick. All right, shout out to my man, Exos Mafia, another very good friend of mine. He's going for a normal one. He just wants a normal player pick. He's going to straight up open it. Um, he got Tierney last time. He's an Arsenal fan. The only other two Arsenal players I'm pretty sure he can get a Saka in form and Martinelli in form. So I assume, I assume he probably doesn't really care that much about a Arsenal player because he's already got Tierney. All right, here we go. He's cracked it. He's cracked it. 
Oh my god, mate. What has happened? These are like turned a lot worse than last time. I think Diaby, yeah, I'd probably go with Diaby, I mean, rating wise, but like, these have been pretty bad so far. I mean, my Gwendozi was actually all right, I guess, but like, mate, what is. I think they've genuinely made these worse. Like, I'm not even kidding right now. I actually think they've made these worse. All right, shout out to the man Bushlight. I think this is number four or five of these so far. I actually don't know how many we've opened. Um. Uh, I'm, at, I'm actually confused. I don't know. I think it might be five. I think I'm pretty certain this is number five. I might be completely wrong though. Anyways, let's see what he gets from his Future Stars reunion player pick. All right, he's cracked it open. What's it going to be? Oh my God. Okay. He's already got David. He's two informs. He could go for an inform, I guess, because you do need them for SBCs. Or he takes David for the higher rate fodder. I don't... I, I I, think as he's already got David, I'd personally probably take one of the... I mean, he could go Telemans, I guess, but it's not that great of a card. The two informs are probably better, I guess, in terms of doing future SPCs. Oh, God, mate. What is going on today with these picks? He's gone for David. Fair play. He's gone for David for the duplicate for the SPCs. I guess it's not too bad. It's not too bad. All right, shout out to the Mantino. He has got a player pick on the Xbox. We're going to try and reveal one on the Xbox. It's a lot harder to do because it's like through Twitch and, and stuff like that. So it's quite harder to do, but we're going to try it. Let's see what we can do. All right, here we go. Here we go. From right to left. Oh, thank God we're not starting it with the team of the week. That's inform of a Meccano, right? That's actually decent. That's a solid card. Like he's already had like a few upgrades already. So that's actually a dub to kick it off with. That's a very good center back. That's a very good center back. Player number two. It is an inform. It's going to be end on Bele. Uh, but Upper Meccano, that's already solid. Like, it's going to be quite hard to beat that. It's going to have to like a, a, a top tier one from these player picks to beat that. Player number three is a Rule Breakers. It's going to be Kulaveski. Okay, Kulaveski, or however you pronounce his name, I might have butchered that. And then player number four to end it. What do we see? Probably another team of the week, right? Is it? It's not. It's a Europa League card. It is going to be Isaac. Okay. Um, I'd probably say Upper Meccano there. I mean, Isaac's got a nice card, but personally, I would take... Upper Meccano. We've got two Swedish players then. Two French players, by the way. Oh, that's a bit of buffering on the Twitch. And yeah, he's gone for Upper Meccano. That's definitely the choice I would have taken there. That's not bad, actually, at all. All right, we've got one of my RTG now. I'm going to straight up open it. I don't usually do this with my own packs. So hopefully it doesn't backfire. But let's do it in three, two, one, bang. Please be something good on the RTG. Oh, you know what? I'll take a trend. I will take a trend. That's actually not bad. I mean, I don't know if he fits my team as such. But that's a pretty good card. I'm happy with that. I mean, Tapsoba's got a nice card as well, actually. That Tapsoba card's good. But Trent is a dub. I'm happy with that. That's actually a dub, in my opinion. I, I mean, 90 pace, full back from the Premier League. Thank you very much. I'll put that straight in the club. All right, Bushler is back, I believe, on his RTT or his main account. One of his other accounts, basically. So, yeah, what we'll do is reveal it. We'll, sorry, reveal it. And let's see what he gets. All right, here we go. Come on, Bushler. Play a pick, please. You know what, as he hasn't got David on this account, that's actually decent, I guess. I mean, he's got, I think, Maradona up top and another decent striker. But David's still good. Even as a super sub, that's actually not bad. Like, at least he doesn't already own him on this account. All right, shout out to the man Goodhue for the final player pick of this video. I think this is like number 10, number 9 or number 10. Let's see what he gets. Can it be a good one to end it? You know what? That's the first time I've actually seen Renan Lodi. I've not seen him once after opening, what, 20, 25 of these player picks? Ruben Diaz, though, is also very good. That's a, I think he's like 200 k So I'd probably say Ruben Diaz. But Lodi has a very nice card. But Diaz is probably the more expensive one. And also the highest rated. So, you know, if you don't want to use him, you can't use him for fodder. So, yeah, Ruben Diaz is actually not bad at all. That's a decent, solid way to end it, in my opinion. Okay, so there we go. That wraps up the second batch of the Future Stars Reunion player picks. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Like I said earlier, make sure you guys let me know in the comments below what you got in your packs. Were they good or were they bad? Are you happy with your pulls or are you not very happy? Let me know in the comments below. But yeah, guys, anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye. <laughs>